I think first and foremost because I mean they're a winning program. I think the culture they developed here. I mean everybody wins. Everybody likes to win. And so they're actually my last offer, uh, I guess, coming out of high school on the junior college kind of circuit route thing. So <clears throat> I liked all the coaches a lot. I thought Coach Penny uh, really knew what he was talking about. Obviously, still does because he's a pitching coach. Um, that's really a lot. I think the culture is really a big thing. I think Coach Avalon really does a good job of, I guess, setting the culture. He's already done that. I mean, a, a winning culture. Um, he has a thing, SOAP, success, organization, attitude, and pride, that um, is kind of a big thing, uh, I guess, in our program. Um, I think that when you get in here, you know, you kind of really don't know what to expect. Um, and as a kid, you're kind of immature. Um, but I think by the time you leave here, you become much better in every aspect of life, like from a, just a, as a person. I think he makes you better people. I mean, he teaches you what to do and what not to do. Um, and obviously as a baseball player, um, we have great coaching staff here. Um, and obviously like today, me and four other guys uh, have been given the opportunity to go play Division One baseball, which is a really cool thing to say. Yeah, I mean, everybody knows who Mississippi State is. So, I mean, it's not necessarily a, like a, how big they are. I mean, they play in the biggest conference and the best conference in baseball. I mean, their facilities are incredible. It's not too far away from home. Um, I think they have all the best resources and all the best coaching to make me the best player uh, after here and develop me more to, uh, I guess, reach my ultimate goal, which is playing professional baseball, not only professional, but major league baseball. Get stronger and get better at baseball. So I needed to get a lot stronger, come from high school, I was two weeks, so baseball was it. So Pearl River is special because you get to be with all your brothers for as long, long days even through the hard stuff and through the, through the wins and the losses. So. You get to be right up there in them dorms with them. So. Well, they, they want to win, and I feel like I can help them win. And I'm ready to get after it at D1 level. I think uh, coming here from USM, uh, the main thing for me was coming here to, to get developed. Um, and then that obviously starts off with the coaching staff. Uh, Coach, Coach Abby, Coach Penny, Coach Jones, who also came from USM and then Coach Lott um, are just, in my opinion, is the best junior college coach in the country. And, and just the development and what you've seen from the past and how players move on back to the Division I level and have success there, uh, it was no question. You know, I kind of had that plan leaving there to come here um, and just get developed. And it's just a great place. And i um, really, really glad I made that decision. Honestly, I mean, everything, um, you know, a lot of people say that, uh, I've heard a lot of people say that if they could be here for four years, they would, and that's the same case with me now. Now I say that if I could be here for four years, I would, because it's just, it's very intimate. I think that's a good word. Um, it's a family. It's very close-knit. Um, you come here and they open you with welcome arms, and it's been great. It's been a great fit so far, and, and I've loved every second of it, and um, I don't want to leave. I, I, I hope that May is a, takes a long time to get here. Um, coming from the Division One level, uh, I entered the transfer portal, but out of high school, I was originally committed here, and I've kind of always, you know, stayed in contact with the coaches. So I always felt like if I were to leave and go anywhere, this was the place to go. So that's what led me here, and here I am. So uh, this this place means a lot. Uh, it's been a couple months, but the brotherhood that you make, um, the people that are involved with this place, the community, it's uh, it's something special here, and they got it they got it going on for sure here. Just going out there, being a long way away from home, and them making me feel at home. The coaching staff was super cool, and I liked them all, and made a good connection with them. And the players were super cool that I talked to, and I enjoyed the place, the facilities. So that's what led me to that decision. I think it was really an easy choice. It's the only only school I visited, and uh, I think knew them as soon as I visited, it's where I wanted to go. And especially, you know, my brother going here, uh, I was kind of familiar with the place and the coaches, and I thought. I just loved it from the, from the jump, so I really didn't have any other school in mind when I first visited, and this is always where I wanted to come as far as UCO, so. It means everything to me, especially. It means a lot to my family. It's kind of been what we've done for the past, I guess, me and my brother, so, you know, it means everything to me. I love all the coaches, I love all the guys here, and I wouldn't, I wouldn't rather be anywhere else in the whole country, so I'd, if I could come here, back here another year, I definitely would. I don't have any regrets at all coming here. So, well, I just kind of fell in love with it on the visit. I loved all the coaches, all Coach Johnson, the pitching coach, Coach Jesse. I just, they really stood out to me. And then as far as the facilities, they're just great. You know, it's LSU baseball. So that part was awesome. And then also, you know, then the Rain National Champions it was kind of a kind of a no-brainer. You know, when they 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 want you uh, bad, you know, you kind of you kind of have to have to give them a chance. You know, because they're 
They're the best, um, and a slugger, everything about it. So.